Now, today's top stories and Power of Five weather from News 5, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Hi there, everyone. I'm Power 5 meteorologist Brian Shaw. Temperatures in the mid 40s for today, kind of cool. Some spotty sprinkles are going to be possible for today. A few rain showers possible for the overnight as well. We drop down into the upper 30s for the overnight. Some sprinkles again possible for tomorrow in the low 50s, but we may even see a little bit of sunshine by the afternoon. Monday, rain showers. Tuesday, morning rain showers. Low 50s on Wednesday, more rain showers and low 50s on Thursday. It looks like we start to clear out a little bit more for next Friday. Good morning, everybody. It is Saturday, October 24th. I'm Homa Bash. Here's a look at your top local stories. A Marlington High School therapist found guilty of sexually assaulting a student that is down near Alliance. John Sohar was charged after touching a 14 year old girl during multiple counseling sessions last year. According to the Akron Beacon Journal, Sohar repeatedly denied sexually assaulting the girl or that he convinced her the sexual acts were part of her therapy. Sohar is set for sentencing next Tuesday. He is facing up to five years in jail. Today is drug take back day in Cuyahoga County. According to a national survey on drug use and health from 2018, 9.9 .9 million Americans misused prescription drugs. Studies show that a majority of abused prescription drugs are obtained from family and friends, including from the medicine cabinet right in your own home. There are over 60 locations across the county to dispose of your unwanted or unused prescriptions. If you don't know where you can go, you can contact your local law enforcement. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.